Hello. Today's training class will be on how to use Google Classroom. What I'm going to share with you today is how to set up your About section and also how to invite students to your class. So what we're going to do is we are going to look at our home screen and if you'll remember this is where all of your classes are listed. So we are going to click on the classroom that we would like to make some modifications to and as you can see here we have three tabs. The first tab is the stream, the second one is students, and the third one is the about section. We are going to click on the about section. First thing that we'd like to do is give our class a name. So we will add that and if you would like to you can give it a description but that's totally optional and because this is a virtual class I'm going to say that this class meets everywhere if you're in an actual building then you can put the room number and then that way everybody will know where to find you you will need to choose save and then it will save for you you'll notice that there are three dots here and if you click on these dots this will give you the option of editing your about section for your classroom but since we like what we have we will keep it the way it is the next thing that I'll show you is how to add materials so let's say that you want to add a video that you would like for your students to watch all the time so you can give your video a title and then the way that you're going to add your video you'll notice that you have a couple of icons here the first one is a paper clip so you can upload files to attach the second one is the drive icon you can add anything that's in your Google Drive you can add Google documents sheets um, images and things like that you cannot add Google Forms the third icon is the YouTube one so this is the one that we will choose and then you'll also notice that there is a link that you can attach to but we're going to go back to the one for the YouTube and you have a couple of options with the video if you have the URL you can click the URL link and then paste your link there but because we're not exactly sure which video that we are going to add we can do a search so I'm going to do a search for well I guess we'll try Google Classroom and see what kinds of videos we find okay here's a video that we can add 50 things you can do with Google Classroom so I'm going to select that video click the blue icon that says add and now this video has been added to finalize it I'll need to click post and now my video is here so if I have to refer back to the video people can just go to the about section and they can watch this video on 50 things that you can do with Google Classroom another thing that you'll need to do in this section is if you have a collaborative teacher you may want to invite them to join the class it's very simple for you to invite a collaborative teacher you will click the icon that says invite teacher and then your dialog box will pop open that takes you to your contacts you'll type in the name of the collaborative teacher that you would like to add to your class and then you click the magnifying lens and it will search all of the names will show up that have the that you've selected put a check mark in the box and then click next and then it will ask you if you would like to invite that person now you can invite up to 20 people to be teachers in the classroom Google Classroom won't let you invite more than 20 but you can invite that many the person who created the class is the person who owns it so the collaborative teachers can't delete the class they can add content to the class they can do pretty much everything that the teacher can except they do not have the permission to delete the class